Hey, welcome back all of my valuable type 1s, 2s, Mahdi's, and Lattice. I'm Ben, I'm a medic, firefighter, and a type 1 diabetic. Now, Dexcom is launching a new ad campaign just in time for this year's Super Bowl. And since the average 30-second Super Bowl ad costs about $7 million, I got a question for you. Do you or your loved one have a magic moment? A moment when Dexcom helped you conjure up feelings of comfort, and helped you achieve a specific goal. Now, can you put a price on that moment? Well, some would say yes, and others would say Dexcom has gone too far. So let's talk about it. The cost. Now, some people say you can't put a price on comfort, but think of the last time you slipped on a fresh new pair of socks or laid on a brand new bed. Or, or even the first time you slept an entire night all the way through because you didn't have to worry about going low. Now some things, they just, you can't put a price on. And well, other things, other things are very expensive and it's hard to avoid that price tag. This year, the Super Bowl is here in Arizona and millions of dollars are going into this event. But why all the fuss? Well, marketers have a single goal, eyeballs. And well, with a record-breaking 114 million viewers the last time the Super Bowl was here in Arizona, it was said to be the most watched Super Bowl of all time. And this is why Super Bowl advertising, it costs a lot of money. Now, according to foxnews.com, a 30-second ad like the one Dexcom will be running this year and has run in the past will cost about $6.5 million on an average. Now the price can further be doubled for every 30 seconds of an additional airtime ad. So is it really worth it? Well, yes, and let me explain. In order for a brand to determine whether or not their ad is really worth it, they have to calculate it using something called ROI, return on investment. In 2021, a Super Bowl ad ROI averaged about five bucks. That's a five-fold return on investment. That means this year's Dexcom Super Bowl ad will generate over 25 million additional dollars. So is it selfish or is it every penny that's needed to develop the next gen CGM? That same gen CGM that helped you sleep an entire night without having to worry about you or your loved one going low. And everyone has a moment. Anyone who's ever worn a Dexcom knows that moment when their life got a little bit easier. The moment when that little plastic thingy attached to your body became more than just a gadget. It's the moment when you wished it was soft and fluffy just so that you can hug it and thank it. For me, that moment was the first time I wore it on my way to a fire. As I pushed my arm into my coat, I remember being careful not to rip off my CGM. And aside from my air pack, this was the closest thing that I had to a lifeline. And I remember reaching into my pocket just to check my PDM because it wasn't connected to my phone at the time. And it was like pulling on a lever of a slot machine. I remember the PDM lit up with the number 127. And I felt like I just hit a jackpot. For the first time in my career as a firefighter, I didn't have to think about being diabetic as a firefighter. I didn't have to worry about having to rip my air mask off just to eat something if I was going low in the middle of a fire. On that day, I not only knew my exact BG on the way to a fire, but I was also able to better anticipate any necessary carb loading that I would have to do beforehand. And that was a magical moment for me. Just a reminder, if content like this for diabetics is important to you, subscribe to this channel and I'll do my best to keep you up to date on what's going on in the world of diabetes. So whatever the cost, Dexcom is now allowing you to share your moment. If you have a magic moment, take this opportunity to let the world know. And here's how. Step one, get a photo or a video that embodies your magical moment with your Dexcom CGM. Obviously it's not gonna be the exact moment, but share something that represents that. Step two, write a caption sharing the story behind your magical moment and share why you're excited 
for the next gen Dexcom G7. And step four, tag at Dexcom and use hashtag Dexcom magic moment. If you do this, you'll share your moment and maybe you'll help that other person who hasn't had one yet. So Dexcom, I realize you're spending a lot of money on this Super Bowl ad. And before I understood ROI, I thought it was pricey and ludicrous. But if you're going to get a return on your investment fivefold, fourfold, and you're able to put that back into the company that has given me magic moments, kudos to you and I hope you change more lives. And thank you for doing what you do. And if you're looking for the most in-depth Dexcom G7 playlist, click here. Remember, I'm Ben, I'm Type Me. I'll see you next time.